has come. Yeah, I'll be right there. A sad, lonely man. He's dirty and hygienic. Brighton Council House on a really dodgy estate. He's, you know, he's, he's at it again. He's at it again, the fat weirdo. You know, he, he's going to end up like Alex Belland. <laughs> He'll get convicted sooner or later for his stalking. Because he's a stalker and a harasser oh, and a bullshit and a knob. Yeah. Mm. What a right knob, eh? You can tell him I'm streaming about him. You can tell him that. Yeah. What a knobhead. What a bell's end. The UK. I mean, if anyone still thinks we're living in a in a world in which we get told everything, no way. Well, we don't get told anything by you, Matt. There we go, when our business wasn't a grift. No, no, no he had genuine plans for tidal energy. Fucking nobbed. I doubt that guy could change the fucking batteries in a fucking flashlight, let alone extract fucking electrical energy from the sea. Yeah, he couldn't extract a fart from his own arsehole, a fucking mug. John Winower, that tramp. That fucking hobo, that fucking nobbed. Holy fuck, lost it. Yeah. See you later, alligators. That was he off? Yeah, go on, fuck off then, you knobhead. Yeah. He's gone. He's gone. I've sent him away. He shat himself. He did a poo in his pants, as he always does, as his kind invariably does. He pooed in his pants. Yeah. And it weren't a big log, no, it were a wet one. It was a feeble, diuretical turd that he dropped in his own pants. Oh, God, Prince Andrew, I fucking hate the sound of that wanker. Yeah, what a knobhead. Prince fucking Andrew, Prince nothing. Prince rubbish. Prince Bellend. Anyway, anyway, I, I'm I'm looking at um 